Hello folks, Geezer here. Hey, this is I think the 15th of December or something like that. And I wanted to let you know, 27th I'm going to do my back fusion, so that's on the books. <laughs> and uh, I'm already doing some of the prep work. But next Tuesday and Wednesday, next week, Tuesday I got to be in Cincinnati at 0800. I'm going to get a full CT scan of my artery chest to pelvis with contrast and then I got to go back the next day Wednesday at 0700 and get uh, ultrasounds to the back of my knees because the vascular surgeon told me people with abdominal aneurysms tend to get aneurysms in the back of their knees too and he said the aneurysms in the back of your knees don't normally burst but what they do is cause blood clots and he said that's a whole other set of problems so we want to avoid that so I get the CT scan see where it is and he did tell me he couldn't feel it so he says he thinks it's still pretty small he said but aneurysms grow slowly when they're small and fast when they're big but he couldn't tell me where they cut off is big and uh, I said, well, this, if it's fixable, let's fix it while I'm younger and healthier than wait until I'm old and feeble. And he said, ah, we don't can't fix, we don't normally fix them until they're at least 5.5 centimeters. And then he, he's the first doctor to tell me why they do that. And he said, because if they fix them, they found that if they fix them when they're smaller than 5.5 centimeters, people develop other chronic problems that stay with them for the rest of their life. He said, so what we've done is created more problems than we fixed. So I don't know why people don't develop them problems when they're that, when they get big. I don't know. It's over my head. But at any rate, I'm here. How long I'm here, who knows? Hope I'm long enough to get that wood unloaded. But at any rate, all right. I'll be seeing you.